YouTube, what is going on? It is your boy Codes EG. Today, we're talking about the NFL playoffs. We do a prediction all the way to the Super Bowl, and who I have winning might surprise you. As always, man, like the video, sub to the channel, and hit that bell button so you're notified every time we drop a new video. Let me know down below what you think of my picks, if you agree, and who you have winning the Super Bowl with the Super Bowl MVP. Without further ado, this is my NFL 2023-2024 playoff predictions and Super Bowl winners. Let's get it. All right, lads. Here is my 2023-24 playoff predictions and who I think is going to go to the Super Bowl and eventually win. Let me know down below who you think is going to win. Let's get it, baby. Let's get it. All right, start with Bucks or Eagles. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This might be a, this might be one of those things that people are like, oh, there's no way. Bucks win this. Bucks win this. I'm telling you, Bucks win this. They're at home. One. They're they're at home. Okay. Baker, yeah, he didn't have a great week, but the Eagles are fucking terrible right now. They are terrible. Hurts looks like he snapped his finger in half. I think Bucks win this. I do. I really do. I think Bucks win this. Lions versus Rams in Detroit. I hate the Rams. They're in my division. But if I'm being honest, this is the best possible place for um, Stafford to go. In all honesty, he's at home in Detroit. He played there for so many years. You know what I mean? And how crazy would it be if he comes into Detroit and steals a playoff game from them? You know what I mean? But also it's vice versa on the other side. Goff wants to get some revenge on the Rams. Look what where you got. You know, you traded me away for this guy and we're going to end up beating you. But at the end of the day, I think McVay and Stafford and that offense is going to be too potent for the Lions. And I think the Lions defense is a little bit of a fraudulent defense in my opinion cowboys green bay cowboys are really 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 good at home green bay has played very good lately could i see green bay winning yes 100 i could but do i think they get it done no because it is in jerry world and dak is stupidly good at home so i think cowboys win all right uh, AFC, Texans, Browns. Texans are home. Um, Texans coming off a big win, the, and they're at home. The Browns coming off a bye. They just got pounded by the Bengals, but a lot of their starters didn't play. In all honesty, I think this is going to be a fire fest. I think both teams are going to just fucking fling the ball, basically. And if, I, if I'm going to pick one, I'm going to pick the veteran experience here. And I'm going to pick the Browns. But I think that is best case for the Texans. You don't want to win too much too early. I think um, the Texans will learn from this loss, come back better next season. Um, Dolphins going into Kansas City. A lot of people are like, oh, Casey's done this year. Casey this, Casey that. Casey's going to win this game, guys. The Dolphins have not done shit against winning opponents all year except for that late win versus Dallas at home. You know, it's going to be cold in KC. The only one that's used to that is Tyreek Hill. I think Mahomes comes out a different animal. And he he got some rest. Kelsey got some rest. You know, a lot of people talking shit. And at the end of the day, they should. But I think we could see Kelsey putting in a playoff we could remember to help pull the Chiefs in and uh, make them a late, great playoff run. So I'm going Chiefs. Finally, Bills, Steelers, Bills at home. I'm going to be honest here. I'm I'm thinking Bills are winning by three touchdowns. Uh, TJ Watt not, might not play. He has a sprained meniscus, or I don't think he's playing. So that defense is pretty good, but I do not think they contain, can contain uh, Josh Allen. And in all honesty, I think Josh Allen and the Bills are on a different time. They're not coming in the playoffs to win game by game. They have one goal, and that's the Super Bowl. And to be so close multiple times, 
to have some tough losses. This is probably their easiest year yet. So I'm taking the Bills. All right. Rams, Niners. Niners will be home. Rams going into San Francisco. It's a divisional game. You play these guys twice a year. Do I think it's going to be close? Yes, I do. I really do. Um, but at the end of the day, if barring any injuries, I think Niners win that. I think it's they're going to win by a touchdown, maybe even two. Um, I just don't think the Rams have the utilities to keep up with it, just in my opinion. Buccaneers, Cowboys. Cowboys are going to be at home in this case. Again, I do not think the Cowboys lose at home in the playoffs. And I think the Buck get their, you know, Hail Mary win. We just beat the Eagles. Let's go. Amazing. And then at the end of the day, I don't think they go much further. So just one sec. Um, just one sec. Girlfriend's brother messaging me. All good. Okay. As I was saying, Cowboys win that. Cowboys beat the Bucks. Um, going over to Chiefs and Bills. Bills would be home in if this is the case. I'm gonna be honest here, guys. I think Bills win at home. Um, this is a rematch of a couple years ago. They already beat the Chiefs in Arrowhead. I think the Bills win this. Um, Browns, Ravens. Honestly, I'm going to be honest here. I think Flacco is comfortable in Baltimore, but I think that Baltimore defense will be way too much. And at the end of the day, they do like to force turnovers. And Flacco does turn the ball over, okay? And Lamar Jackson is hard to tackle. I think it's going to be a very close game. I think Baltimore takes it. So in our conference championship, we have Cowboys, Niners, Bills, Ravens. Okay. Cowboys, Niners. I've The Seahawks played both teams. It's going to be in San Fran, which the Niners play phenomenally well. Outside as well. Cowboys do not. Dak does not play well. One on the road and two outside. And I just think that Niners defense with everyone healthy, if they're still full on healthy at this point after beating the Rams, I just don't think the Cowboys will have enough to um, beat the Niners. I think that defense is going to get a couple extra stops. And I don't think the Cowboys defense will be able to hold off McCaffrey, Ayuk, Seat, uh, Debo, uh, Kittle enough times to really make a difference. I think the Niners win by a touchdown or even two. Niners to the Super Bowl. B hurts me to say because they are in my division. I hate the Niners, but you know what I mean? It's facts are facts. They are extremely good, okay? Bills, Ravens. This one is interesting, okay? This one is interesting because both are on fire. I do think that if the Bills make it to this point, I think with the consistency, if they make it to this point, this will be in the, their last, what is it? I think the last game they won, they won six and one since the bye. Okay. What are the bills since the bye? Okay. Yeah. So when was their bye? So week 13 bye. Okay. From that week 13, they lost against the, uh, the Eagles in OT in Philly. Since their bye, they've beat Kansas City. They've beat Dallas. They beat the Chargers. They beat the Patriots. They beat the Dolphins. Okay. That's one, two, three, four, five, five straight wins. Okay. So if they come in here, boys, if they come here in here on a five win streak, which they are, they beat the Steelers. That's six. That's seven. A seven game win streak. That is a lot of momentum to come in with. Whereas the Ravens, yes, they had an incredible season. They have this bye week that might freeze them out a little bit. I don't think the Browns have the utilities to beat them, but I do think the Bills have the util utilities to beat the Ravens. And I'm taking the Bills. This might be a shocker. I'm taking the Bills, baby. Go Josh Allen.
the Niners versus the Bills in Las Vegas. You know, um, I just, I have a feeling, I really do, that the Bills pull it off, man. I really do. I think Josh Allen is a good enough quarterback to do it. Um, and with Josh Allen, he's so multifaceted that uh, the Niners defense will eventually make a mistake. Niners defense are not great against the run either. And if Josh Allen picks up on that, he's going to run the ball. And he's a hard guy to stop when he does. Look for Cook to have a great game. But again, the Bills defense has to step up like they did against Miami. Josh can't turn the ball over. This is going to be a freaking battle. Don't get me wrong. This is probably going to be one of the best Super Bowls we've seen in a long time. These playoffs are going to be some of the best we've seen in a long time. But I'm going to go Bills to win the Super Bowl. Um, obviously, Seahawks were there. We're, we're going Seahawks. But we couldn't beat the fucking Steelers. So we're not here. But I'm going Bills to win the Super Bowl. I know a lot of people are going to either hate on it or have difference of opinion. I love it. Let me know down in the comments below what you think, where you think I went wrong, and who do you got winning the Super Bowl. And I have Josh Allen as the 2023-24 Super Bowl MVP. Those are my takes. Let me know yours. Let me know down below. Catch you on the next one. Peace.